This video reviews finding the volumes of 3D shapes. We have a sphere, a cylinder and a cone. And we want to find an expression for the volume of each of these shapes. And this revises the formulae for the volume and also involving algebra as well. So a sphere volume is given by 4 thirds times pi times by the radius cubed. But in this case, the radius is given by not r, but three lots of r. So the volume is 4 thirds times pi times by this entire radius to the power of 3. Now to work this out, I've got a cube, both the 3 and the r. Now 3 cubed is 27, r cubed is just r cubed. So this becomes 27 lots of r cubed times by pi times by 4 thirds. This can be simplified. 4 times 27 is 108 pi r cubed all over 3. So 4 times 27 over 3 pi r cubed. Sometimes this does also cancel down. Um, 3's in 108 is 36 pi r cubed. And this is a simplified expression for the volume of this sphere. The second one is a cylinder. Now a cylinder's volume is given by pi times by the radius squared, that's the area of the circle if you like, times by the height or the depth. But in this case the radius is 2r and the height is 5r, so this becomes pi times by the radius squared, times by the height. And as before, we always try to do the brackets first. So 2r squared, 2 squared is 4, r squared is r squared, 4 r squared. There's a pi here, there's also a 5r. Then to finish off, we then do 4 times 5 is 20, there's a pi, and r squared times r is r cubed. So a simplified form for the expression of this cylinder is 20 pi times by r cubed. The last one is a cone. Now a cone volume is given by a third times by pi r squared. That's basically a third of the area of the, uh, of the base, which is a circle, times by the height. So to work this out, it's a bit like the sphere and the cone, sorry, and, the, and the, the cylinder merged together really. There's a fraction, a pi r squared and a height. So a third times by pi, the radius in this case is actually 3r squared times by the height, which is 5r. As before, we'll do the bracket first. So 3 squared is 9, r squared is r squared times by 5 r, times by pi, times by a third. So we'll times all the tops first. Now 9 times 5 is 45, one lot of 45. So we have a 45, we have a pi, and r squared times r is r cubed. So 1 times 9 times 5 over 3. And again, this can be simplified. There are 15 threes in 45, so 15 pi radius cubed. So a simplified expression for the volume of the cone, in this case, is 15 pi r cubed.